Hey guys, this is part two of my, you know, everybody wanted to, act, to have me tell you about the home workout DVDs that I have, what I use, what I love, what I, what I don't use, what I recommend, etc, etc. So the first DVD I talked a lot about <sighs> my huge crush for, uh, huge workout crush for Kathy Friedrich, who I have been a fan of forever. And as I mentioned, if you didn't see in that first video, you know, these are all Kathy Friedrich videos that I've had for years. See that? So these are all of, of the ones that I, my most favorite, um, and she is being kind enough to send me um, some of the ones that I don't have anymore that have either gotten lost in the move or somebody stole them and never gave it back. Um, and then she did just recently send me the new X-Train, which is extraordinary. I just cannot wait. I cannot get over how much is in here, how thorough it is. You know, you've got chest, back, and shoulders on disc one, buys and tries on disc two, burn sets on disc three, super cuts on disc four, legs on disc five, disc six is cardio leg blast, disc seven, all out, low impact hit workouts, disc eight is hard strikes, boxing and stuff. And then disc nine is Tabata size, so all Tabata. And then a whole separate DVD for if you have a spin bike at home, um, which I'm going to get. So talked about Kathy, she's one of my favorite. I also talked about that when I first started doing working out, it was Tybo. And so I have some old Tybo DVDs, which are really DVD versions of the um, VHS tapes that were Tybo Advanced Live that are freaking awesome. So you can buy these at Amazon. I don't know if you can get them at Collage Video or not, but I tend to buy I tend to buy Kathy videos direct from Kathy.com. I tend to buy a lot of my um, workout DVDs from Collage Video because you can preview the videos there and then see what other people have have written them up with um, as far as their review. So that's what I talked about in my first video. Now, what else do I currently use that I really love? Um, I did recently just start to bring this back. Um, I bought. Um, insanity a couple years back and I like it now let me give you a caveat I don't ever do with all the Beachbody pro programs that I love I don't ever do like the way that they sell this is you buy insanity and you just do insanity for 60 days or 90 days I would get bored out of my mind and I love Shanti and I love these videos um, I need weights I need diversity and I it's just not my thing um, so when I buy these, I'm never buying them to just do that program. I'm buying them to mix into everything else. And quite frankly, I, I just, I don't know, it makes my day better. You know, it makes my, when I'm planning out my week and I'm like, hmm, what do I get to choose from? That's just how I roll. So I have started, um, I incorporated one of these last week and it was kind of nice um, to add this into the mix. Really high intensity, obviously, um, and, and just a different vibe. So I've brought Insanity back. Never ended up doing Insanity Asylum. I have to tell you guys that. I don't know why. Um, one second. And then, I showed this to you guys before. Got this nice little container for the uh, DVDs that I didn't like the container they came in. So I got this nice little CD case from Best Buy. Now this has all of my um, Tony Horton one-on-one, -on -one, which I, I really do like. Um, some of them I threw away because they're just not my, my style. Like one of them was a bunch of pull-ups. I don't have a pull-up machine. And I'm like, why am I even keeping this DVD? It's stupid. Um, he does have a lot of um, yoga ones here. Um, and then what I did too, as you can see, is I went through some of the ones that I actually hadn't done. There's weird titles to it. Um, well, that's not weird, but like um, Power 90 Road Warrior. Pfft, I have no idea what that was. So, you know, I previewed that. I wanted to put on here, hey, this is a 55 minute workout. You only need bands. Cardio intervals, 40 minutes. Like I want to have an idea when I'm picking out a DVD. Is this something that's 20 minutes? Is this something that's 30? Is it 50? What is it? Um, so I have all of these labeled. I do tend to, I, I think these are good. The only thing is, I mean, obviously, Tony Orton is somebody who thinks he has a really great sense of humor and it kind of comes off as bizarre. I don't know, most people don't realize that he did not intend to go into fitness, but intend, from what I heard, um, he intended to be a stand-up comedian. So that kind of explains the awkward jokes that don't really fly so well. Um, not the only one that said that, and I'm a big fan, but, 
um, plyo legs, upper, middle, lower. That's a, another hotel room workout that has no equipment. Um, just arms, that's great. And then of course I have rev apps, which um, let me disclose that our friend Brett Hobel is um, now uh, a big part of Fit Flangel. He's an awesome guy. But I've had rev apps for a while. And I went through with all of these as well. Because sometimes, I don't know about you guys, like if I look at rev abs power intervals, how do, how do I know what that is? Is it 60 minutes? Is it 10 minutes? Is it 15 minutes? Do I need weights? Is it more cardio? Is it both? Um, so I went through and I, I labeled all of these so I know exactly what they are. That helps me when I want to choose what I'm going to do for the next day. And then of course, I've got P90X. Now I will be honest with you, I, um, you know, P90X is a great program. I tend to not use it right now. I will use... Um, the plyo, because I love plyo. But as far as weight training, if I'm really gonna do isolation weight training, I mean, this is just my opinion. If you're just getting started, P90X is a great thing. But once you kind of know what you're doing, it, I don't know, I just feel like if I go to do chest, shoulders, and triceps, it's just very traditional, like repetitive, one set, one set, one set. So if I'm gonna do my weight training, it's gonna be at the gym. And if I'm gonna do weight training at home, and this is just my opinion. Um, I'm not going to do P90X because I'm going to do something more like Kathy Friedrich who mixes it up a little bit. You know, Kathy's going to mix it up with either um, high reps or, or different versions or just muscle confusion. I, I just don't feel like I get that with P90X. I think maybe P90X is targeted more towards people that are new to weight training. And it that for that, it's a great program. So I don't want to discourage you. I just... I think maybe if you're a little bit more advanced in, in what you're doing, you're going to kind of be like me and find yourself moving past P90X. I, that's just my opinion. And again, it's just my opinion for where I am right now. It doesn't mean that this is a bad program. I think it's a fantastic program. The other thing too is, like I told you before, I love all of my Beachbody programs. I personally don't tend to get P90X and only do the P90X program or only do the Rev Abs program. Sorry, I like to do them and then put them in like, you know, my arsenal of, of training and sorry, um, and then I can, I can pick and choose what I like. So again, P90X, um, I tend to just do a little bit of it. I really love the Tony Horton one-on-ones and now two of my newest things that I'm just absolutely outrageously, like I almost can't say enough about it and I'm just kicking myself for not getting Turbo Fire earlier. But Turbo Fire, I am absolutely in love with. I, there's, there's a couple things that went on with Turbo Fire. A friend of mine lent me Turbo Fire, and of course I, I saw the infomercial come out and I wanted it. And um, I was like, this is gonna be amazing. Then my friend Jessica got pregnant. She's like, I'll lend you my copy. And, and when I got it, I pulled out a DVD and I, and I went to um, do my workout. I had just injured my shoulder pretty bad where I couldn't do any kind of punching or anything. It's a kickboxing type of a thing. So I go to do the, the DVD and I couldn't do it. And then I remember instead of doing what I should have done, which is, you know, you start at the very beginning, learn the moves and then progress. I went right into like the 60 minute workout. Well, if you're choreography challenged like I am, not a good idea because you're gonna see people doing things fast and go, screw this. And that's been my tendency in the past. I don't do group classes at the gym. I don't catch on quickly. And I think two things happen. That's what happened. My shoulder was injured, so I couldn't do any punching. I also picked a very, probably one of the 60 minute classes and I didn't, I thought the choreography was too complex and I never went back. Let me tell you something. I could kick myself for that because I am enjoying this so much. Number one, um, let me also disclose that Shalene Johnson is a friend of mine, so I adore her. Um, and I just guess I had no idea how much I was missing out on this. This is so right up my alley. It's kickboxing, it's boxing, it's, it, it's, it's everything that I love in that style of workout. The music is amazing. Shalene is adorable. The people that are in it, I just, it's fun. I, I can't get enough. Not to mention, can, hello, do you see, I, I don't know if you can tell how many, of course, when I order something, when I go, it's like go big or go home. I order like the whole thing. So this is like the advanced set 
but um, you know it comes with so this is your your fire star I have just been doing like fire starter pack which I have to put this back in here um, and let me just show you <laughs> because I'm being smart this time I'm starting at the bottom and I'm learning the moves so that I can you know totally know the moves and then I can I can progress but that said I don't know about you guys there's DVDs out there where if you start at the bottom the instructional tape is going to be very slow even her instructional tapes look at this well I don't know if you can tell but see here it's 35 minutes and then I wrote there it's 300 calories so um, she has all of these um, workouts and they're all labeled can you see that they're all labeled like fire starter class now that one's not labeled but it's 30 what did I say 35 minutes I burned about 300 calories in that one then there's a stretch 10 class so if it's stretch 10 that means it's 10 minutes low hit 20 class that means it's a low impact hit workout 20 minutes then there's a low hit 25 class stretch 10 just on this DVD alone there's one um, one two there's five workouts just on this then there's this extra one I think this was a bonus so this has greatest hits hit workouts ab igniter class and a stretch class and then <laughs> I haven't even gotten into this I think I've done one of these yeah because I put the label on it fire 30 class <coughs> excuse me stretch 10 hit 15 stretch 10 fire 55 easy class stretch 10 core 20 class stretch 40 class stretch 10 class fire 45 class stretch 10 class hit 20 class stretch 10 class fire 45 easy class stretch 10 class hit 25 class stretch 10 class sculpt 30 class tone 30 class stretch 40 class stretch 10 class fire 60 class stretch 10 class hit 30 class stretch 10 class upper body 20 lower body 20 stretch 10 abs 10 and stretch 10 seriously this is all just turbo fire and I'm just gonna tell you I cannot say it enough how fun these workouts are I love that there's workouts that are 20 minutes that are um, an hour that are 45 minutes I mean pretty much if you want to get your sweat on You've got every single option you have here, you can possibly imagine. There's stretching, there's, you know, there's also some bands workouts as well. And forgive me, my voice is horrible. Um, this is just honestly some of the funnest workouts I've, I've had in a while. And I could kick myself for having missed out on a year, a year and a half of this stuff. I can't recommend it enough. Of course, let me be honest with you guys. If you want to order any of this stuff, any of the Beachbody stuff, full disclosure, I am... Um, an independent beach body consultant you can order it off of my site which is on my website excuse me beachbodycoach.com slash Kelly Alexa I will make a commission if you buy this from me so but I'm sure you can tell my my opinions are my own I've been talking about this stuff for a while then I also just ordered Les Mills combat which I knew this was gonna be right up my alley but I just love it maybe it's also because these people have European really nice British accents there's that as well. I, it's kickboxing. It's it's hardcore. It's fast paced. I absolutely love it. Um, this obviously doesn't have as much as the um, Turbo Fire does. Um, doesn't cost as much either. Um, I, excellent. Uh, what I tend to do is I'll do if I'm doing Shaleen's, um If I do like a Turbo Fire in the morning and I'm going to do cardio that night, I'll do this. Vice versa. So I mix it up and then I mix it up with my other cardios as well. But it's just freaking fun. The music's fun. The people are fun. The accents are fun. Shaleen is awesome. I mean, I just, I'm like a kid at Christmas right now with, with all the fun workouts I have at home. Now, to wrap up with what I have left in my arsenal, um, so we've talked about Kathy Friedrich is <coughs> a favorite. Love my Tony Horton one-on-ones. I love Insanity. Love Les Mills Combat. Love um, Turbo Fire. Love old school Tybo. You can get this on Amazon.com. Um, now, some of my other ones that I love. Physique 57. This was sent to me. Um, this will blow your mind. I cannot get over how hard this is. And it, I really need to do this again probably this weekend. It's about an hour. Talk about getting your buns and your lower body on fire. You you just cannot get over what this woman does. I. It's amazing. The only thing is, I mean... I love this workout. I just can't imagine 
Like some people say that's all they do. Maybe if I was going to the class, that's, that's it, but I can't imagine doing this every day and I love it. I can't imagine only doing this class every day. But I do love it and I would tell you you're crazy to not buy it and any other DVDs they have because you'll do it and just be going, how is this even possible? Um, and it's an hour, which is nice. Ultimate sandbag. I have my ultimate sandbag out in with all of my um, equipment. Now, Josh Henkin, full disclosure, is one of my Fit Fluential ambassadors. Ultimate sandbag is just freaking awesome. You can do so much with it and you can customize those workouts. Um, he has a ton of videos on YouTube. It's just... He's just awesome. I mean, you almost don't need a DVD. Um, this is another program I got from Beachbody. I don't tend to do it as much. I think maybe more so because of the personality of, of the person. I, I don't know why. He just tends to be a little cheesy. But I will say this. This was, when I did this workout, I was like, this is not, there's no way this is going to work my butt. A lot harder than you think. Um, and, and again, I don't know why I tend not to do this one as much. They are good workouts. I guess I kind of feel like I don't know how it fits in. It doesn't feel like it's total cardio. It doesn't feel like it's total, you know, just working on your, your legs or working on your legs hard. So for me, this is maybe more of a mental block. I, I just kind of don't know, you know, if I put this in, if I'm doing 25 minutes, what is this? It's not high intensity cardio. It's working my bonds. Like I just kind of don't know how to fit it in. You know what I'm saying? Um, so that's just my thing. Now you all know, if you've been watching me for a while, I am the biggest fan of this woman, <laughs> Ilaria Motignani, who has a new series out right now, but I have, how many? Five of her DVDs. Now, the first one that I did was, um, where's Body Strikes? This is Body Strikes 2. Um, this is Body Strikes 1. So this is the one that tends to be my favorite. Body Strikes 1, level 1, and this is level 2. Once you go to level 2, you don't want to go back to level 1. So I have to be honest with you, I never do level 1. This is about 45 minutes. She's just awesome. I mean, I, these videos, the way she teaches them, the way that they progress, um, I, she has this adorable accent. Um, I, I just love her. She's hardcore. She also has abs and push-ups. <coughs> Excuse me. Athletica, which is more you know, weights, and then this is Power Strikes. I haven't done Power Strikes as much. I think I might need to do that this weekend. But I love her, I love her style. I wish she'd do more, quite frankly. Um, I think she's a very good teacher. She has this adorable accent. Oh, and then this is just more Ultimate Sandbag. Um, so that's kind of my, my arsenal that I'm using for right now. Um, I'm very, I, I enjoy all of these tremendously. Um, but this is what I narrowed down to the ones that I use all the time and I mix and match. <sighs> I'm tending to at this point, hold on, do most of my, primarily all of my weight training at the gym. Wow, I'm really losing my voice. Um, I'm, I'm, my tendency is to do uh, all of my weight training um, at the gym, but then what I am doing is, you know, for example, if I'm if I'm home for a week and and Michael and I can't train that day or whatever, I'll probably take X train um, or another one of Kathy's workouts, and and then I'll say, okay, you know, I need to do chest and triceps, or I want to do you know an upper body blast, and I'll do that at home. I've got so much equipment <laughs> and stuff at home that I can do a really great great workout, but having these as a guide is like having a really kick-ass trainer here. So hopefully this helps you with what I'm currently using. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to email me. I'm happy to answer them. Um, and then again, you know, if you want to um, order the Tybo, go to Amazon.com. If you want to order any of Kathy's, go to Kathy.com, C-A-T-H-E.com. And if you want to order any of the Beachbody stuff, flatter me. Give me a few extra bucks and you can order from my... Um, <coughs> <laughs> my Beachbody website, which you can link to from my kellyalexa.com, or you could just go directly to, I think it's, um, I should know this better, um, beachbodycoach.com slash kellyalexa. Um, but anyway, that's it. And then my next video, the last video, I will um, kind of review the stuff I don't use right now, but a lot of these are great workouts. They just don't fit in with my routine. So that'll be next, okay?